or, or be gray about what he was saying. And any woman who has been the recipient of unwanted sexual advances, a married woman, by the way, is who he's describing, uh, is cringing, is, is physically reacting to what they heard. And I, I'm horrified. I'm saddened. And I cannot even believe at this point that we are even considering putting him in office knowing what we know. To your point, Bill Clinton, was they tried to impeach him. They did for his actions. Him. It is a stain. It is a stain. But he is not who we're trying to elect as president. We're trying That's to elect right. the first woman president. It's not right. It's, none of it is. But it is also not right to think that we would elect someone who we knowingly, going in, talks about sexually assaulting women, talks about women the way he does. And I'm sorry. It's just, it's not okay. It's okay. It's okay. Take a sorry. moment. Um, when you both consider uh, the events over the next 36 hours, uh, you're going to have a debate on Sunday night. And That's right. Uh, I mean, so Matt, wh where do you um, think in 48 hours we are in this campaign? Then? Well, first, I'd like to just to say to Marjorie, there's a lot of there's a lot of emotion, and uh, and I and I just want to connect to the fact that I think uh, these statements are repugnant. Um, and I think the fact is is this: when you're a candidate at a moment this when you're going through a crisis uh, it's very rare that you have a big moment immediately on top of it and here we're going to be Sunday night at the second debate uh, and it's all in Donald Trump's hands he's either going to continue to own the fact that what he said was wrong um, uh, and and apologize uh, as he did last night which I thought was a really good first step and connect okay. to voters in the end in a democracy the voters are going to decide whether or not they want him in this big job to both of you, thanks. Matt, Marjorie? Thank you. It's going to be okay. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> mm. A lot going on uh, and a lot to talk about today, and we are all over it on location here in St. Louis.